guys it is Sunday morning and we are getting ready for church I was just gonna do a little video to show you guys how I obtain this uh, physique right here and what I do in the morning is to just get ready get started and do your hair dad hurry up and uh, usually it takes me about two hours to get ready in the morning so Michael, um, hurry up we're gonna be late again listen, don't rush me hurry I, uh, up dad just take that Usually, when I'm in a shower, I do an exfoliator, again, oh, and on. then I use some um, other face cream stuff that keeps my face looking good and um, like a baby. Um, well, we really don't have time to go into everything this morning, I guess, to get the to show you everything I do to get ready. But um, <laughs> we'll show you another day. How about that? It but, don't take me long. <clears throat> We are getting ready for church, and we will be yeah. headed out here in a little bit. So, we'll see you guys. Um, I think he's telling you guys a lie because he steals my face moisturizer every once in a while. And it takes him maybe five minutes to get ready every day. I have to use your face moisturizer because I, I get razor burn when I shave. So I'm usually the one that makes this light. No. I, um, I use that every now and then when I actually do shave. Usually I just use my little grooming thing and just trim it up. So that's what I do. Sometimes mom makes me late. Guys, we are finally headed to church. All got our nice little church clothes on. I'm wearing the shirt I wore last night. I'm wearing blue jeans all night. They look good, he said. But we are on our way now to, um, we're going to go to the 915 service, but we didn't get ready quite in time. So we're going to the 1115. And, yeah. But I'm super excited about church today. I don't know, a lot of you probably heard about six months ago about the um, lady in Indianapolis that um, got murdered in her house with her little boy there. Um, and her husband, Davey Blackburn, her name was Amanda. Um, they used to go to our church and he moved out there to start a new church. But he's going to be at church today um, preaching. So I'm really, I don't want to say excited, I don't know if that's the right word, but anxious to hear his message because I'm sure it's going to be really good. And um, he's just been so strong through this whole situation. So I can't wait to see what we can learn from him. So we're looking forward to that today. And then we're just going to kind of hang out as a family and just chill well we are at lunch when we love to go to the 9 15 service because then we can go home and cook but the 11 15 service by the time we get home and cook we're all starving so we just came and grabbed something so we decided to go to way back kyle's got his grilled cheese me and dad both have bacon burgers they're watching bowling what bud me you I what did. I didn't know what to do out. So we're just enjoying our meal. Church was super good. And we're gonna go home and just relax today, I think. And we might and we and we might go to TBCY too. Yes, and we're gonna go to TBCY, T C B Y um this evening. I promise God we go this weekend and have a coupon. So. <laughs> I just got off the phone with the builder today. Um, it was a really big day for us in the house process. We were just finalizing. <laughs> Hey guys, um, I'm on my bike right now, as you can tell, wearing a helmet for safety, and, uh, I am going to, um, make an intro for my bike tricks. Okay, so I'm going to do some bike tricks in a few minutes, and I'm ready for y'all guys to see it.
guys, we are fixing to do another taste test with Kyler. He has a new kind of Mountain Dew, so he is going to introduce everything to you guys. Here we go. I am, as you can tell, I'm, I'm drinking another new uh, flavored Mountain Dew. It's called Mountain Dew Pitch Black. It, it's black too. And I'm going to give it a try. So, cheers. To all the, to all the people that are that. Mm, it smells pretty good. Let's give it a try. What it smells like. It smells like, uh, it just smells like normal, it smells like flavored Mountain Dew, kind of. Very descriptive. Slow down, taste it. Good. Zero to, remember we have to describe what it tastes like and give it a score from zero to ten. Um, I would probably give it a score of a thousand. Uh, and it tastes so good. Especially when it's shaped up. And, um, I, I would say, I don't know what it tastes like. It just tastes very good. And, bye-bye. <laughs> We had some new people. I can't talk tonight, guys. I think you said was well, something came in the mail today. No. <laughs> um, no, we're not doing that. We had some new people move into our neighborhood, and Kyle went and met them today and was playing with them and having a good time. So one of them teach yeah. me how to play bet, how to like hit the ball. Yeah. Well, awesome. But um, I know I was telling you guys this morning on the way to church that Davey Blackburn was going to be at our church speaking, and he spoke, and it was such a good, um, just like, message that he spoke. So I'm going to link his message in the um, info below. It won't be up till Tuesday because our church doesn't put on their things online until Tuesday. But I'm going to put that there, and if you are going through any kind of a discouragement or anything, um, I would encourage you to just watch that video because I know I'm not even really going through a tough time right now and it encouraged me. So what did you think about it? I mean, it's just still sometimes hard for me to understand how he is so quick to forgive. I mean, it, it's been five months, six months, but yet at the same time, I know if something happened to you, it would be next impossible for me to forgive your killer every day. And that's not even what his message was about. His message wasn't about forgiveness. It's just about going through a tough time and what it really means. And um so yeah, it kinda amazed me and that, you know, when you go through a tough time like that, you know, you're gonna question things and it's completely normal and legit to do that. And that doesn't just mean question other people, I mean, that's, sometimes that means questioning God, like, why? Why did you do this to me? There's nothing wrong with that, because to understand God, you have to understand why he, things happen to you. And, you know, I mean, he's, he's working through all that. You can tell it's not an easy, it's not easy for him to deal with, which nobody expected it would be. Mm -hmm. but. but I was thankful that he was willing to talk to our church, because... I think he helped a lot of people, and hopefully some of you guys will watch that, and he can help y'all too. 
But um, we hope that you guys are liking these vlogs. I say that every night. No one's saying they don't like them. Put a thumbs well, up. Well, we did have one jerk kind of come on and make a negative comment about us and unlike all our videos, which hey, is fine. Yeah. I don't know his name, which is fine. We don't care. But <laughs> if y'all do have suggestions, like, we want to hear them. Okay. Um, put a thumbs up and, and no thumb, and we don't like You can give us a thumbs down. I don't care. It's there for a reason. <laughs> Uh, y'all can get, y'all can subscribe and put some comments and if you don't subscribe, I'll eat your fries. But, um, another thing I was going to tell you guys is Kyler is starting his own channel. It's going to be called Being Kyler Brown and we're going to have his first video up, um, about tomorrow. By, no, probably tomorrow we'll have it up. So, I will link his channel in the description bar below and y'all check it out um he's just gonna be doing kid stuff he did like a nerf gun war type thing today um review and recorded it so that's gonna be his first video i recorded like this um i i like play i i shot my guns and and like i i had a, um I, I had a competition with all the guns and see which ones shot the farthest but if y'all want to see it it was the old zombie strike double. Well, you can yeah. tell more about it in your video, but that's going to be being Kai Brown, and it's going to be in the description bar below. One other thing that I, I haven't talked to Brittany about this, but um, me and Gus talked earlier, and Gus is wanting to start his own YouTube channel. Oh, what do y'all tell us what y'all think about that, below? I think he would do good with the YouTube channel. He doesn't like the camera. Well, we could, like, maybe dress him up. Like, we could have requests of different costumes. We could put them in and stuff. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> I was merely joking. <laughs> no, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And we will see you guys again on Wednesday. I bet Kyler Brown. Kyler Brown? What? Let me show you a part of it. If you don't subscribe, I'll eat your fries.